Up next, what is a 10 kilowatt solar system? Hi, I'm Jonathan Green from Teho, the place where Australians save time and money as they make the switch to renewable energy. Check out our website for more information and subscribe below for more great renewable energy content. At Teho, we get asked every day, what is a 10 kilowatt solar system and do I need one? This is everything you need to know about a 10 kilowatt solar system. How many panels is a 10 kilowatt solar system? Solar panels range in sizes from 300 watts all the way up to 400 watts per panel for residential installations. The size of a solar system is the accumulation of solar panels to create a system size. Using a 370 watt solar panel as an example, 28 by 370 watt solar panels will achieve a 10.36 kilowatt solar system. If you remove one panel to 27 panels, you'll achieve a 9.9 .9 kilowatt solar system. It's just that simple. How much electricity can I expect to generate from a 10 kilowatt solar system? On average across Australia, you can expect a 10 kilowatt solar system to produce 40 kilowatt hours per day. This figure will differ depending on site specific variables such as where the panels are installed, the pitch of the roof and any obstructions. Solar will produce power during the day, which your home will consume first. The excess power generated will be sent back into the grid and you will receive a feed-in tariff. To achieve the greatest savings, it's best to consume as much solar as possible to offset the high consumption tariff on your electricity bill. Do this by switching high ticket appliances such as pools, washing machines and so on to operate during the day. Can I install a 10 kilowatt solar system? In most cases, you can install a 10 kilowatt solar system regardless of where you live. Some distribution areas may limit the amount of solar you can install or most always limit the amount of inverter capacity you can have. They do go hand in hand though. If you're a single phase home in the most common distribution areas across Australia, to install 10 kilowatts of solar, you'll need to install an 8 kilowatt solar inverter or two 5 kilowatt solar inverters. In both of these scenarios, the distributor will require the site to have an export limiter of 5 kilowatts. Export limitation is where the inverter can produce its maximum amount of potential, but it can only send a certain amount back to the grid. This is to protect the grid's infrastructure. If you are in a three-phase home in most distribution areas, you can install 10 kilowatts of solar with no export limiting. Is a 10 kilowatt solar system right for me? Understanding what size solar system is right for you can be a difficult process, especially if you overthink it. If you are a large user of electricity, spending greater than say $600 per quarter, 10 kilowatts of solar is a good option. It will create enough electricity to make a very large decrease in your electricity bill. We suggest also really considering the future. It's likely the next car you'll purchase will be electric or a plug-in hybrid, which means you'll need to draw from the grid to charge your car. The alternative is to install a solar system that is large enough to cover your current needs and your future needs. If you're not sure on what system is best for you, it's good to leave that up to an energy expert by speaking with an energy expert from Teho today. If you're considering installing solar for your home or business, give us a call on 1300 22 92 92 or check out our website for more information www.teho.com.au That was everything you needed to know about what is a 10 kilowatt solar system. I'm Jonathan Green from Teho. Thanks for watching.